All right, Darren, a early season first place second, Gillingham this weekend. How has preparations been during the week? After a win, it's always a lot easier. There's a, there's a real good energy in the group. You can imagine uh, being sat at the top of the table is a, is a nice feeling for the players. Playing against teams that we're not quite familiar with, so that makes it more rewarding. And uh, the players managing the, the moments in the game, and uh, I think that's our third clean sheet now in this, this new league. So, yeah, everything's going really well. Players are playing with smiles on their faces, and uh, yeah, it couldn't be better. It was a continuation of brilliant form last weekend with your win against uh, the Devon rivals, we won't say their name. Um, what do you think will be key this weekend? Gillingham are second in the table, they perform well. What do you think will be key to I think preparation is going to be important just because of the distance. Uh, we're travelling up on the day, so it's making sure that the players can travel four to five hours, get off a bus and then perform. So we're, we're very mindful of that. Um, and then it will just be you know, talking about the, the tactical aspects of the game, which the players have been really astute this year, and uh, giving it everything they got. It's three wins from three, a perfect start to Merit League One. Um, do you think there's now an expectation when you go to these places to go and get a positive result from the club, from staff and from fans? Well, there's an air about the, the football club at the moment, whether it's clean sheets and winning football matches. It's a real nice feeling. But I think the expectations come from ourselves at the football club in the standards that have been set. And uh, every single member of staff, player, are trying to drive those standards. And uh, I think that outcome um, is, is successful.